Okay. Now Bailey and I are going to work on the one, two, three pattern game. This one is pretty hard to explain while I'm doing it because I need to talk a lot. So I'll probably do a voiceover to explain. And cue the voiceover. So pattern yeah, games are these yeah. predictable little games Ready? that have the same outcome every time. They're very repetitive and they're a great way of adding predictability to unpredictable situations like leashing up or nail trims or any other sort of handling things. Uh, this is really great for both anxious dogs and hyperactive dogs. In this case, I'm teaching Bailey this because she's a little more anxious. For the one, two, three games specifically, I'm kind of teaching her how to count. So the very first step is to say three and then give her a treat, which is what I'm doing here. I'm just saying three, treat, three, treat, three, treat. And then once she starts to show a clear understanding that three means she's gonna get a treat, I'm gonna start back chaining numbers. So next I'm gonna go two, three, treat, two, three, treat. And then again, once she starts to understand that, I'm gonna go all the way to one. So the final step is one, two, three, treat. One, two, three, treat. Two. And yes, this is very simple. All I'm doing is counting to three and two, giving Bailey a treat. Three. But the idea is to teach her that if I say the number one, two, it means that in a couple more seconds, three. she'll get a treat. <laughs> so if you stick around to the end of this video, I'll show you a way in which that can be used. Specifically, I'm going to show how it can be used for handling. Just gonna She's not every now that and then. touch shy. Two, but if she were three, to be kind of aversive to petting, two, nail trims, ear cleaning, three, any of that sort of stuff, this would be really good for that. Two, three. Here you will see exactly how three, I am using one, two, one, three for handling. Two, so what I'm doing is I'm saying one to prepare one, her, and then I'm saying two, two as I pet her, and then as soon as I say three, I stop petting. And all the pressure one, is off. Two, if you were to do this for something like nail three, trims, you could say one, two, as you're moving down your dog's one, leg, and three, two, and you release your grip. Three, or three, if you're doing three, leashing, one, two, as you okay. slide the leash over their head, and then three, as you let go. As I said before, adds predictability to unpredictable situations. Because as soon as you say one, the dog knows you're just going to say two and three, and then it's going to be done. 